Hello, this is Lars Vemje from MamaWorld.com and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to fix inaccurate tracks in Mocha Import Plus for After Effects. I'll show you this workflow for a corner pin, but the same technique can also be used for stabilized precomps or moving properties. Here we have a problematic track in Mocha. As you can see on the first frame, the corners of the surface rectangle are accurately placed on the corners of the plate that we want to replace. But if we scrub through the clip, you notice that on the last frames, the track is quite a bit off. Here you can also see that the plate is a bit curved, due to the rounded shape of the door. To fix this, we have to export our tracking data in Mocha and import it in Mocha Import Plus. Then we drag our insert clip in the composition, make sure that we are on the first frame and apply the corner pin function. Since the door of the car is slightly curved, we will use the Bezier Warp Corner Pin so that we are able to bend the straight corners of our insert. We also have to make sure to select the option to use expressions instead of keyframes, since only with the expressions based method you can add your keyframes on top of the track. On the first frame, the corners are exactly where they need to be, but we need to move the Bezier handles a bit to bend the edges of the insert. Now the first frame looks good. If we scrub through the timeline, you can see that a little bit of the white is visible at the right border of our insert. Now we'll go to the last frame where everything still looks ok. And with our corner pin layer selected, we type EE on the keyboard to reveal all of the properties that have expressions. Since our tracking data is expression driven, this reveals our four corner vertices and the Bezier handles of the Bezier warp. In order to save some space in our user interface, we'll select all of them and then click on one of the triangles to hide the expressions and only see the properties. Now we want to insert a keyframe for all of them. But let's first try to create a keyframe in the usual way by clicking on the keyframe button in the timeline. As you can see, the corner pin jumps to a completely different position. This happens because After Effects does not consider the expressions when inserting new keyframes. To avoid this, we have to undo first, then create the keyframes again, but this time by clicking the keyframe button of Mocha Import Plus. As you can see, now the corner pin stays exactly where it is. This keyframe button was introduced in Mocha Import Plus 5.1. So if you don't have it, make sure to update. Now we'll go to the frame where we have the biggest tracking error, in this case right before the plate disappears. And because only the right side is still visible, we'll only insert keyframes for the right vertices and triangles, and move them where they should be. Now we'll scrub through the timeline again to find the text frame with the biggest tracking error. In this case, it's the last frame of the comp and we can use our keyframe button again to create keyframes for all control points and then move them where they should be. If we play the clip back, you can see that we achieved a pretty good result with only a few keyframes. Now we can continue adding more keyframes until we are happy with the result. If you want to find out more about Mocha Import Plus, you can visit mamaworld.com or get a free trial version on aescripts.com. Again, my name is Lars Vemje from mamaworld.com Thanks for watching and goodbye everybody.